I don't believe anything is impossible. I do believe very much so that the word impossible, you break it apart, it says I'm possible. My name is Desmond Blair. I'm from Dallas, Texas. I'm a project manager by day and I'm an artist by night. What makes me unique as an artist is that I was born without hands. I don't think in terms of disability, I think different. And that's always what has been reiterated to me is that you're gonna have to do things differently. You can have 10 fingers and 10 toes and still disable yourself by your attitude, the way you think, telling yourself what you can't do because of your circumstances. Constantly meeting people, that's what keeps me inspired and not only just meeting them, but learning about them. And so when I paint a person's portrait, I'm not painting a picture of them, I'm trying to paint their story or capture a specific moment or piece of their essence. Black History Month and the lessons from it, it gives you a foundation in the present day to kind of build off of and branch off of. And just knowing that there was someone there who opened the door for me as an artist to be able to do that, and Lois Milo Jones was able to do that, to me there's a responsibility I feel that I have in the present day as an artist to continue to carry out her legacy. Lois Milo Jones wanted to be remembered as an artist. She was a respected college professor, mentor, and a trailblazer in the civil rights movement. She was invited to the White House eight times, spoke at 15 foreign embassies and dozens of college campuses. Mrs. Jones was fond of saying, at 90, I've arrived. If Mrs. Jones was here today, uh, I would like to tell her thank you because without her contributions, I don't think I would be able to pursue art in the way I've been able to pursue it. And not only that, share my perspective in the way she shared hers. And hopefully I can blaze a trail for African-American artists, but not only African-American artists, artists with physical differences.